what kind of trees are those on? Right on, right on, right on, right on. You know, I, you're not there. Right Every time we come to Mississippi, right on, I always go all over and see your people and stuff. We go to my city, you get all grumpy. Uh, and uh, now, wait just a minute. We went to your own town. One time. time. Well, well, shit, and you left me on the highway. <laughs> Drove off. <laughs> Ron, didn't he? Oh, we <laughs> oh, that's what I said. Left me. We went in another car. So we didn't want in the car. Oh, I'll tell you what. I know I ain't going to go with I, I tell you what. I want you to go with me sometime, like I go okay, with you. Okay, okay. I'll tell you what. I don't want to go this time. No, uh-uh. You got it. No, I want to go when I want to go. Same way you do. No, you got to go. Don't to be to forced. Go. No, we will. Like bread. Me? 
cheese with a lot of butter on it. I, I like I, a lot of butter in yeah, it. Yeah, I like a real lot of butter. <laughs> Before we got married. Well, I would have time to experiment, I guess, like if I didn't have to be in the studio and all. I think I'd probably be really out of sight cooking on some other things. You know? Uh-huh. The one dish thing. But one thing I sure would like to cook is that tuna casserole. Uh-huh. Yeah. I don't know how. Oh, that's really easy. Oh, you know how? Yeah. Well, I just found out that seasonings is the most important thing. All these right. little stuff in these jars and things. Like one time I was at the studio. Uh-huh. And uh I had nothing that I did. I had to cook with scraps. Mm -hmm. And it was so good. And I used everything from jars mostly, mm -hmm. you know. And it, 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 it was just seasoned like to the, I mean, to the taste. God, it was so good. But I remember one mistake I made, I had dinner. And I always tried to do it up, where you just have just a liver, like spaghetti or something, you know. Mm -hmm. It's always like, okay, like, you know, giving a dinner. If you don't know what you're doing, you, know, uh -huh. you don't cook the other way, you know that it'll always go. Telephone, Craig. Who is it? Craig, telephone. Craig, hey. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and this meal right next to it. Chase now. <laughs> <laughs> and it's nowhere on the chase now. <laughs> Yeah. It looked like I was flying. 
Really? Here they are, Ike and Tina Turner. <laughs> Tina Turner, I forgot to mention, you're going to Japan for two weeks, perform at the, how do you play it, Mugan Nightclub? Yeah. Mugan Nightclub, uh, June 20th. Yeah. You've played Japan before though, right? Yeah. Is it, uh, most people who go over there, entertainers, especially musicians, come back and say it's a, it's a real gas because they're familiar with the records and they collect them and they're great collectors over there of, uh, of American songs and jazz and so forth. Well, what is it like? Do you find it different? I was worried at first because I was thinking, well, they don't know what I'm saying and all this while screaming and dancing, you know, what are you going to think? And they, it really went over great, you know. That's, oh, you, yeah. that's universal. Uh, yeah. They, they know what you're doing there. <laughs> they know what you're doing. <laughs> Do you find any of the Japanese cities different? Or are they basically the No, but you same? know one thing that really fascinated me? <clears throat> the first thing I do when I get up in the morning is open the, the curtains and all. And I look down and all these little people, well, the older generation is shorter than the, than the younger generation. And they all sort of walk on the same side of the street, even downtown. Say, for instance, like, all the people that are going, 
They go on the same side of the street and the people that are coming on the same side. So you don't have that hassle of sort of bumping into each other. That makes sense. Yeah, and, and all downtown it was like that. Even not just, uh, you know, the places where they work. And, right. and they were all, they looked like little ants because I was up so high and they were so migrating out of this tunnel, yeah. you know, and going in. You want to hold it down, Ike? <laughs> Maybe you can set something up on the back of that. No, it's all right. I'm gonna give you that. That's all right, Blue. Blue, it's okay. Uh, 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 that's, that's okay, cause uh, I just wrote it. Uh, you know. You know that 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 that's our food. One for you, one for me. You know that you know that stand that I got for that bass, uh, that that piano bass. You know what? I was, yeah. Long time ago, years ago, when I had trouble out of bass players. I got the piano bass. You know that like I like I was thinking maybe that that mug, that mug will sit on that stand. I can use that stand if you know where it's at. Okay. Like that's the fourth piano I put in this place. <laughs> So finally I got the piano that, 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 that's got the sound that I want. You know what I mean? Yeah. In this world, you got people crying because they're happy. Right. You got people crying because they're, they're sad. You got people crying because they're in pain. You got people crying for sad reasons. Old people that didn't have homes with them. Yeah. So you're saying if you have the nickel and the dimes for the for the eyes of the world, for, for the crying eyes of the world, mm -hmm. the eyes is crying something because they the, the crying eyes because they shit. Mm -hmm. If I had the nickels and if I had the dimes of the eyes of this world, the eyes that can't see for crying, um, the eyes of the cold, something, I don't know what the next one is, the crying eyes of the cold, of the old. I'm trying to tell you basically that it's the crying eyes is the people that's crying because they're happy, so people see people in love and they go, oh, you know. And then you got the people that's crying because they're hurting in pain. Everybody's crying. Yeah, mm -hmm. but everybody's crying. Yeah. Even of yeah. all, all, what I'm trying to tell you, of all things, but I'm trying to, the last one, I want to be like, based on something love, because everybody want to hear about, about something about their love. And then the loved one is because her lover has left her. What would I do? And if the ride comes in, somebody help her, and then the group is back, help, help. Yes. And then I go into my story about, about something, I don't know. But, but, but listen, it's, it's, I got to, I got to narrow it down where it makes sense. But this seems like it should make sense. It 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 does because I, if I had the nickels and if I had the dimes yeah. of the eyes of the world, the eyes that can't see but crying. There it is right there. Right. But, but I like to say things in my song. I just don't like to write songs. And I say nothing. I want to say something. You know what I'm trying to yeah. say? Like just what I just said then, it says a lot. Because who ever thought of like the eyes in the world? Like people walk around blind and other yeah. people walk around can see, but their eyes are full of tears. Poetry. Yeah, right. I guess so. Oh, really? <laughs> anyway, but I gotta get more into reality about the crying eyes of the different people. I wanna make it more into reality so you can see a picture of happy people crying, sad people crying, people in pain. I don't wanna dwell on pain in the army because that's been done too much. But I wanna dwell on pain and tears, love and tears, happiness and tears. Aha! 
happiness and tears. Love and tears. Pain and tears. Pain and tears. Oh, Handful of gimmick. Much obliged. Much obliged. Right on. One, two, three, four. Hey, hey. Ooh, Ooh, me. Do it. Do it. Do it.
it right. Do it right. What you mean, do it right? Shake a tail. Oh, feather. why don't you bend over and shake your own tail feather? Well, why don't you bend over and shake your Listen here, you dirty rat. Why don't you shake your own tail feather? Now there was a day. Yeah, we'll call it the show. For them. You say you take them in front of my eyes. Do they keep them in? And they're going to confuse them coming back tonight. That's going to be a few over the weekend. They're going to be a few over the weekend. They're going to be a few over the weekend. They're going to be a few over the weekend. They're going to be a few
know what he got. Well, then he, he comes home to his respect and understand it. But then when he gets home, his old lady's already heard about it. One of the things she says to him is, uh, Tessa, I heard about you today, about last night, and night before last, with your other woman. But he had the nerve to ask you, which one? Yeah, he wants to know who told you. Well, now listen, you can tell her, tell her you heard it. Will you tell him? Tell him! Let me hear you. childhood, the mother and father not getting along, yeah. separating, and I went through the whole thing, so, and then uh, they have like sort of, I had most of that money sort of kind of like an unhappy marriage and that sort of thing, so I keep, I keep thinking that I really like what happens. Oh, Even when, when your mother was growing so up, Bernie was, was like, running. really like considered old for a woman, uh -huh. she was like, yeah. A woman being really. Right. And like today, a woman in her 50s and 40s is still considered a young woman. Uh -huh. It still looks great. Right. And like for instance, like when I get in my 50s, I'm still not going to be considered an old woman. My strong night chart says that later in life, things get better for you.
down to Fred Charles to recognize that. What I say by Rare Earth on WLF, it's 519 with Bob Sherman. I don't believe I ate the whole thing. <laughs> I don't believe I ate Jesus, the I whole thing. No, no, Ralph. I ate it. That's the way it is, folks, at What's Your Beef Restaurant in Canelo's oh, Plaza. Nine evenings at What's Your Beef and enjoy the his and hers <laughs> prime rib dinner. His, a regular man-sized, delicious, and tender prime rib. Hers, a petite, succulent cut. Each with a big, flaky baked potato and a satisfying toss salad. All this for only $7.50. This song is from one of our albums that says, What you hear? It's what you get. Stand by and what you feel better yet. And the song says, I've been loving you.
You got what I want. And you, you got what I need. Now stand by and go back to white. And you got it. You got what I need. And, uh, and baby, I want you to mash it on me. And I want you to, I want you to give it to me. I want you to make me say.
as you know by now, that we never, ever do nothing nice and easy. It's because, you see, we always do it nice and rough. We're going to take it again on this song, and we're going to do it easy. Then we're gonna do the finish. Right. This is the way we do. Proud man.
people always ask him what he's talking about. I know. <laughs> I still say, I still say to Tina, and then told me to get ears clean. I just think some people speak clearly when they want to go. What they say? <laughs> he. Today's trend, today's trend in dressing, today's mm -hmm. trend in music. Uh, um, I know I can't picture of you like years ago. Yeah, it's it's like incredible. That's right. It's like you look at a lot of people now, and they're doing the same thing in makeup. They're doing the same thing in wigs, you know, and the same thing in clothes. And you just can't do it. You got to go with the world, and that that's how we've maintained it. You know. Yeah, I'm home a lot now. Um, as a matter of fact, I'm home all week, Monday through Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Oh, good. Lunch. We can go to lunch someday. Right. <laughs> and um, you know, really, has, it, it doesn't affect me, uh, except for like the days that I get my appointments mixed up an hour late. <laughs> I won't even go into that Saturday <laughs> here. I mean, you know, I <laughs> but other than that, you know, I'm I'm I'm, a, I'm an active person, so I'm always, I'm I'm always running. To the laundry, the cleaners, the sinks, just so like whenever I have an appointment, it doesn't really bug me. I just, just, um, it's just a part of the, a part of it all, a part yeah. of the entertainment, you know. So I just take it that way. It doesn't really, doesn't really upset me or anything. I'm recording when when I cut the tracks, when I cut the, when I write the lyric, and I go in and knock it out just like that. But that's usually at night. It looks great. You look like a queen. Oh, really? I'm gonna stay up here. <laughs> Really well, you know, I don't understand what kind of a writer I am. Some might eventually tell me. I sort of write about, I get sort of tired of writing about the man and the woman unless it's something really different, really strong. So I just don't want to write anything. I love you, you know, I love you, you know. <laughs> so I just try to write like anything, the plaque on the wall, the twiddling flower, or anything that, that's, uh, you know, like sex is a thing today. So I try to write about like a little bit about like hinting, why is that sex? You know, just anything, just sort of the hip. 
I thought of, I, so I, 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 I thought of, in my writing, I like to, I, I want to be really like with the hip thing, because everybody's like a sort of hip bag. You know? yeah. But I find that a lot of it I'm not able to use. Like one song I wrote, K got laid, Joe got paid. <laughs> but, well, you know, a long time ago, laid was when you got drunk, uh -huh. you know? So then uh, it's really a groovy song. And Ike says, well, the only thing he could do was like go to the, was the FCC and, and get the definition of laid and so forth. But, but then he says, to keep that, well, he's going to fight it. Because like, it's really a clean song, really like, just like the typical prostitute today, really like, you yeah. know. But it's a clean song, really nice groove and everything. But I find myself writing that way, and I, and I it's, it must be the other me or something, you know, because I don't know. But the, it's just really weird. And that next album coming out, I wrote all the two. Every one of them? Every, every, all yeah. the tunes, since Nuff said, I wrote them all. All about, er, about oh, everything. Yeah, they do it It's a document. It's a document. Documentary, yeah. And um, it's, I, I've gotten used to it. I, I, I mean, I've never been aware of where she's there anymore. She's been doing it for a while now, so the camera's always on. And I'm not one of those to stay posed on the camera, so I just go, you know? And then I look back, I go, wow, look at myself. And occasionally, she comes up and she, she, can, she can hook the thing up to a television, and you can see what she's got on it, you know? And oh listen, I, you know, so amazing. I look so huge on that thing. Everybody else looks about their size. I am actually like an Amazon. Oh, yeah, I just hate, I hate to talk about it, because it's, yeah. Strange enough, things happen to me. If I discuss them, something always happens. Whether she gets sick or whether she have to go home. So I just, I will say, you know, I remember one day I said, I lifted my finger just the other day, this fingernail here. And these two had held over, but these three had broken. Now they are back, right? I said to myself, amazing how this fingernail stay. And I turned to me, I said, Miss, let me get out this bracelet. So with this bracelet, it's hard to open. And as I was doing this, I did, and broke the nail. Oh, yeah. And it happens with me every time. Every time I say, Hmm, so and so hasn't been here. Boom. Yeah. There they are. You, it never fails with me. So I don't discuss things that, that's, that I don't want to happen. I know, right? And at the bloom, the people that understand.
turn around. Let's say, ah, 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 ah. We should be even, even. Look, right. even. Let's do it. Let's do it then. Slow. Turn. I'm 